Hey, this is Pat Heyman from patheyman.com, and today's tip I'm going to show you how to customize your nutrition goals in MyFitnessPal. As part of the setup process, it's going to make you put in your weight and your fitness goal, whether to maintain, lose, or um, gain weight. And based on that, it's going to create a nutrition plan that it thinks is right for you. However, it might not be right for you. So if you want to change the goals, what you do is click on the menu, then goals, and then you're going to choose calories and macronutrients. Tap on calories and it'll let you change your calories right here. So you can change it to whatever you like and hit the save button. And then click on carbohydrates and it will let you set your macronutrients in increments of 5%. This is the free, the free version. If you pay for it, you can set them in, um, in um, more precise increments. And you can also directly enter the number of grams that you prefer instead. So this is the main reason why I like my fitness pal better than my net diary. In my net diary, you actually have to pay to be able to do what you can do for free in my fitness pal. At the bottom, it'll tell you the total percentage and it won't let you enter or exit the screen. Um, we won't let you save your changes unless it equals 100%. So if you see if I make it 45, now it says it's 110 and it grayed out the little check bar. So now I can go back and not save them but I can't save them unless I make it equal 100%. That's all for today's quick tip.